Wait, it went out, me and sure my cord on that should be. Oh. Oh. Okay. But hopefully you are all doing okay today and staying safe and home. Welcome back to some Minecraft Special Paradise Gold Age. <sighs> Sorry, I need to take a quick breather there. But episode 930. Hopefully you are all doing okay today and staying safe. Okay. So. I tried to record this episode a little while ago. But here we are with attempt number two. But hopefully you have been doing okay today and staying safe. So, last episode we got started on working on mining out a area before we got distracted by a... What was it again? What was it again? Sorry, I'm just doing this now. Before we got distracted by a cave and trying to figure out where it leads to and figuring out that it actually leads over to our... This is the right, yeah? Yeah, yeah, okay. Sorry, I was just checking that. That it leads over to our train station under the stairs where our old cave that I went into used to be. So that was quite a surprise, I tell you. Ah. Where there's torches, that's where we're supposed to break to. You know what? I didn't realise that that was just floating there for ages. I just took it down there. Uh, you know what, I do want to make an area of my world where, well, not, yeah, area of my world, yeah, somewhere in the world, I want to do like a little area where I can uh, have a mine shaft chest, well not mine shaft chest, oh, I'm just so exhausted, I do apologise, I do apologise, I tell you, but have a mine chest, ch chest, no, Minecraft chest, in a mine cart, just uh, going around the base, or even in a mine. I would like to do a mine build. I'm planning on doing a mine build somewhere over in Boxtown, over in the hills. Yeah, over here. So I plan on making a little mine shaft and a little bit over here. That's also a mine shaft, but it, this is the walkway that you go down into it. And this be where the elevator that does not move, because it's going to be static. So I would like to do a, you know, one that's not static, I tell you, elevator. I would like to do one of those. But they are quite a pain in the butt to do. You know what, just break that anyway. I don't really need that. There we go. But this will just be a chill episode, because I'm... Whew, a bit exhausted, I tell you. But I do want to get this build done, so we'll just keep on cracking at it and see if we can uh, get a good sizable chunk of this done, I tell you, today. Okay. Well, I guess I would call this the part one, and this would be the part two, and that would be the part three. Well, this part two and three would be together, yeah. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven blocks, that'd be... Yep. Seven blocks from this right here. Right? No. Let me double check that. Let me double check that. So, that's six right there. Yeah. Seven blocks in. Yeah. Okay, well that should do. One. That was unexpected. That was definitely unexpected. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. This was a little mine shaft that I decided to keep here. Turns out, you know. We forgot to mine into it. You know what? I totally forgot that even existed, I tell you. Totally forgot that even existed, I tell you. So I guess that area right there. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, uh. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. 
there we go. Not too bad, I tell you. Not too bad at all. You know what? I really do enjoy this area, I tell you. But it's just such a pain in the butt moving all of these mine shafts, I tell you. The mine shafts has to be one of the worst things about this area. Though it is probably the best thing as well. Because sometimes you can work it into a build. And then sometimes it just gets in the way of builds, I tell you. But I think another plus to it, I tell you. Is that you get so much oak from them, I tell you, when you're breaking them down. And plus they also mine out a lot of room for you. That you don't have to mine yourself. So that's another plus. Just sometimes they get in the way, I tell you. Uh, there we go. Not too bad at all. Not too bad at all. Yeah, I might actually make the roof higher. It's just really depending the now. Will I or will I not? You know what, I'll actually shave it down from the front. As this will probably be the best, you know, option here. I'll start to break it all from the front. And see how that turns out. And then break this out. There we go. So to that wall right there. Yeah, not too bad. I was shaving it from the front now, we're doing it at the side now. I know I kind of just switched it there. But you know what, it's, it's, it's easier to go to the side as well. We'll have to head to the other side in a second. You know what, I wish I could climb up vines, I tell you. I think that's one of the things that I always hated, I tell you. That you cannot really climb up vines in Minecraft. Like, they're there, but once they're, you know, kind of loose, you're not able to climb up them. And it kind of makes sense, they are quite, you know, something that's very hard to climb in real life. But that also annoys me that, you know, you're not able to climb up it in Minecraft. Ah, uh, let's see. There we go. Not too bad, not too bad at all. Break all of that. You know what, I always find it so satisfying just going around in circles. Slowly, just, you know, surely. Slowly but surely, you know, just slicing it slowly down. It's like eating a sandwich, but you know, eating the outside and then slowly eating into the middle. That's what it's like, I tell you. There we go. That is not bad, I tell you. That is not a bad job at all. Pick that all up. I still have room. Did I miss anything down here? Of any use? No. We do have quite a bit of iron. Mm. Sorry about that. I burped there while I was trying to speak. But we do have quite a bit of iron now. Uh, do, 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 do. There. So that is one. That's three, four, five. Six, seven. There we go. That'll help us start to mine out this bit. I'll actually just shove that lava there. There's actually quite a bit of lava around here, I tell you. Ah, oh, I hear a witch. I hear a witch. It's somewhere. Somewhere. And it's being sneaky. There we go. Alright. You know what? You know how you can make bone blocks, I tell you? How do you make bone blocks again? You know how you can make bone blocks in Minecraft? 
I really wish that you made it out of actual bone. Or there was one that's just actually out of bone. It had more of a ribcage design to it. Kind of like, you know, a plank of wood. I feel like that would be a cool idea, I tell you. I feel like that would be a cool idea. Eh, let's see. Because I, I was thinking there, I tell you. I was just thinking there. And I thought, you know what? You know I make uh, bone box with bones, right? But then I was, I was starting to doubt myself because I thought, you know, I made it with uh, bone meal. It'd be kind of stupid if you can turn bone meal into... You know, you can turn bone blocks into bone meal and then not turn it back into, you know, bones. Ah, uh, let's see. So I saw that there. Ah, uh, let's see. I said, you know what, that'd be stupid. Luckily I did check. Sorry, I'm getting distracted while I'm working on this. Luckily I did check. And it is, you know, correct. It is bone meal. But I feel like, you know, there should be another option, I tell you. Like, you have these weird bone structures in the nether. But you don't see, like, you know, ribcage kind of design one. Like, there is, you know, ginormous ribcage, but... I mean, and then, like, you know, a detail version of the, you know, regular block. There we go. You only see, like, you know, a bone block with a roundish circle on the top of it. That's really all... It was kind of sad, I tell you. Kind of sad. I do wish there was more to it, I tell you. Okay, let us go and head over to my other backpack. Ugh. You know, I'll actually chuck that one out as well. Put that in there. There we go. Not too bad, not too bad at all. Do I have any room? In my backpacks? Barely. Barely. You know what? I'm pretty sure I can cut out this, but then I guess we'll have to, what do you call it, make a pit stop, and then I think that'd be where we'll wrap this episode up for this part. Yeah, we'll see. And then we'll do the other half next episode. There we go. That's not too bad at all. That's not too bad at all. Oops. I'll miss that block there, I tell you. Yeah, that's not bad. That's not bad at all. Yeah, I remember when chunks used to break in Minecraft, I tell you, and then it would either be, you know, you get like a full bedrock wall, or you would get like, you know, a big chunk of, you know, like, you know, stone, like in the middle of your build. I remember those days. That was a very weird time, I tell you. Eh, well, let's see. We're seeing them in other people's builds. That happens when you update your, uh, to call it, Minecraft. You know what? I would love to, uh, update our, you know, Minecraft Jungle Paradise Golden Age up to newer updates one day, or maybe even use, uh, future, uh, MC mod? Is that what you call it? That gives you all the, the newer stuff. Maybe use that one day, I tell you. Ah, uh, let's see. Because it would be cool to, uh, what to call it. Use some of the newer stuff, I tell you. Primarily, you know. Probably, hmm. What is in the newer updates? I guess Mangrove is an interesting thing. Put that in 1.12.2, I tell you. That would be great. I'm pretty sure that mod either got, you know, singied or something, you know. Did it get singy? Like, destroyed at one point? I saw it got destroyed at one point by, like, you know, oh, you can't do this, you know, something like that. Probably not, maybe it's my imagination. Eh, uh, let's see. But I would like to use that one day, or even update the mod pack one day. But I tell you, that'd probably be never. The thing with 1.12.2, I tell you, is that it's stable, but mods are normally for 1.12.2, they never really head higher up. And if you see a lot of the people that now work for the Minecraft, you know, the, the, they used to be mod developers, you know, like you've got the more creatures person in there, and more creatures, 
sucks now, I tell you. The only time that Mo Creatures, you know, was really good from now, back then, probably would have to be back in 1.7.3. Add to the Black Scorpion. Never seen that. Something like this. Hmm. Your name will be Drake. Draken. Drakeno. Drakeno. I think you're the only one to survive out of your type, am I? Drakeno. Yeah, I'm afraid so. I'm afraid so, my little friend. You're the only one to actually survive out of your entire family. Oh. Oh, I heard a spider. I thought, you know, I had a little bit of hope there, I tell you, for Drakeno's, you know, other siblings. You know what? That is actually the first time that we've actually seen a dark scorpion, I tell you. They don't normally spawn, I tell you. They don't normally spawn. But that's pretty cool, I tell you. That is pretty cool. A dark scorpion. I haven't seen one of those before. Or many of those before, I should say. Pretty sure we've seen at least one or two. I don't... No, the nether one's red, yeah. The nether one's red. The regular one is like a brownish copper kind of look. And we've not really seen a dark version, the black version of it. Hmm. It's like a wizard colour. Score. Yeah, you can make like scorpion armour. We were currently working on making ourselves some uh, nether scorpion armour. Or even just normal dirt scorpion armour. You can make a dirt scorpion sword. That I would do not recommend because it actually takes away you know, damage away from it. It all is quite cool looking. Drakeno. It's a cool name, I tell you. Shout out to all my Drakenos out there. There's probably one of those out there. <laughs> no one names out there, I tell you. Do you know what? The, one of the best, you know, surnames that, you know, is like the best. Like, I wish I had this one, I tell you. Being Potato. That is the best, you know, surname, I tell you. That is the best surname, I tell you. I would love to have potatoes, my surname. Eh, uh, let's see. But that's, uh... I think maybe 400,000 people, or maybe 40,000 people have potatoes, their surname. And it's mostly in Asia. Why? Because surnames don't really translate that very well, and it's probably translated from, you know, something else like, you know, potato means strong. Or something like that, I tell you. And then it's just translated wrong, and now it's just, you know, it's a vegetable potato. <laughs> oh, forgot all about that. Okay, I'll see you in a little bit, Dracano. So, let us go and head over to. Where do we need to head over to? You know what, we might actually use Dracano as a, like, escort vehicle. Pretty sure you can ride them with a saddle. Not too sure. Not too sure. Maybe I'm getting your know, arc, you know, mixed up with the game. You know, old arc, I tell you, was really the best arc. Like, I would love to see, like, a mod out there that actually re is it back to the past. You sot! There we go. I saw you over there, don't think I did not see you. You know, I really do like this, I tell you. It looks like it's lit up, I tell you. That, that's a kind of cool feature, I tell you. There we go. And this backpack. I can actually chuck in here. I will probably actually need some of this, I tell you, so I will keep some of it on me. Oh, 
There we go. Not too bad, I tell you, not too bad at all. No, 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 no. Nether bricks go miscellaneous. There we go. Not bad, not bad at all. I need to work on my dyes and I need to work on the wool, I tell you. Hmm. Well, I guess I could sort through all the wool that I have there now, I tell you. You know what? Yellow? I have a stack of that. I might as well just chuck that in. Just chuck that in. It's not needed. Brown wool as well. We actually have quite a lot of brown wool. Actually, I did need to use brown wool for a certain needs. Brown wool is used for that old studied leather kind of thing, yeah. Animal hide. We were working on getting the berserker armor set with that. You won't manage to take that back. Okay. Wait some one wait there's the wait, wait, wait one second, I tell you. Wait one second, we'll go empty out our backpack. And do 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 I've got so much to check out. So much I tell you. You know what I'll actually keep all the ones right there, I tell you. Check the flint out as well. Took that. Don't need that. Keep that. It's always good to have that on me. There we go. Uh, I'll actually keep that on me. I do need that. I don't know why I have it in there. Should have had it in the other thing being the shulker. There we go. There we go. Swap to the other backpack. And just start, you know, chucking all of that out. We don't need much of this. Brown wool in here. Grey wool in here. I just have so much wool in here. That can go. That can go. That can go. Don't know why I chucked the thingy there. Should have just kept that on me. Polished under side. There we go. Just chuck all of that out there too. We'll go and see if we can uh, make some more pieces to that uh, berserker armor. You know, for the longest time we could not get brown dye. Well, not brown dye, but brown wool. So it's good that we have now, you know, kind of an excess of it now. Good that, I tell you. Good that. Just chuck that there. Just. Well, this is a miscellaneous thing. I should not be sorting it all out now. Keep that over there. Chuck that, chuck that. Put that up there. Put that up there. Uh, do I need clay? I'll just keep it on me. You know what? No. Chuck it out. Chuck that. Chuck that. Chuck that. Put that. Put that. Put that there. I <laughs> landed someone on top of the chest. That's impressive there. Go like that. That, that, that. You know what? I'll just chuck some of that wood in there. Yeah, not too bad to tell you. That can go in there. Not too bad to tell you, not too bad at all. A little garbage area. Recycling centre. You know what, I really need to set up a better uh, storage area, I tell you. I think I'll probably set that up in the deep underground lush caves. I would like it close to home. I was thinking about putting it over at that other place where we have our, you know, nether brick roof. 
where we started the episode. But then that is kind of not the really best idea as that area is quite close to where I'm going to be building the museum. So I would just scrap that idea and, you know, not do that. Not do that, I tell you. Oh, I have itchy nose, I tell you. There we go. Oh, there we go. Okay, so let us eat some big potatoes so I can run. Don't want to waste your time. Okay. Run over here. And how much of the... That pickaxe is about to break it out. Do I have it in here? No, that's just OG armor. I should just chuck in the museum, I tell you. If you don't know what that is, at one point in my world, I got wiped. It was very early on in the series, actually. Yeah, yeah, it was early on. Hmm. I would say maybe episode 30. And we, uh, we would later pay for it. We sacrificed many diamond blocks. So that I could get my armor back and the, the stuff. And it turns out that I did not lose my armor to the, what do you call it, wizard. It was just above the little entrance bit to the tunnel that I blocked off for like over hundreds of episodes. Ah, eh, we'll see. But that's just a little neat story there. Okay, it looks like I only have one piece of that. But I don't really have leather. Okay, let me head down to the house. A wee! Ow. A wee! Onwards. Okay, let's see. Some miscellaneous, I think. No, I do have some in here. You know what? We have quite a little bit of, you know laser I should really go on a little bit of a journey and go kill some mobs. I was planning on doing that soon I tell you. I was planning on doing that soon. Alrighty right right. I can make four. That allows me to make the boots. Bam. The boots. After all this time, that is all that we... <laughs> oh, that's sad, I tell you. I thought I would, man I would manage to at least get the leggings, I tell you. But no, no. You do not get the leggings, sadly. I was really hoping that I would be able to make the rest of the armor. I guess it takes some time, I tell you. You know what? I have really enjoyed this little uh, area in here, I tell you. I don't know what I want to add to it, I tell you. I tell you. This area here, I tell you. Our trophy room. It has went through many changes. I really like the way that it is now. But I do not know where I would like to take it one day, I tell you. I don't know where. I don't know what it would be like if we wanted to change it. We have, you know, the very powerful bow. Go pow, pow. We have special arrow as well with it. Then we got the nether obsidian armor. We got the ruby armor. That's not too bad, I tell you. Yeah, it's four off of the main armor, but it's like, you know, near iron. And all that mage armor. Our Christmas armor that we have. Blaze armor. My good old ender dragon armor. I don't think you could fly with this, but I wish you could, I tell you. You have a little bit on the back, but you know, you don't have wings. It would be great if you could. It would be great if you could. You know what, I like going out and looking at this window, I tell you. I don't really see this area, you know, that much. <laughs> Bill is looking through me. Looking at me. Looking at me. So, that's where we're going to end this. Have a nice day, safe, up to the summer. Maybe the summer's just. Take with the vitamins, very important. And bye, see you next time, everybody. See you, see you. Bye bye.